Hello and welcome to the career section of success. In this video, I will be going over many of the academic opportunities at the university. Choosing a major is an important step and choice, whether you are a prospective student looking to learn more about what SIU has to offer, or a freshman or sophomore looking to change majors. There are some things that you should consider before choosing a major. You should take your interests, personality, strengths, and career parameters into consideration when looking for a major, but I don't want to overwhelm you in this video, so I will be discussing these topics in future videos. The one I want to focus on is what kind of degree you would like to have. The two most common are, are a Bachelor of Arts and a Bachelor of Science, but did you know there are slight differences between the two? A Bachelor of Arts focuses more on humanities such as philosophy, literature, history, social, social sciences, art, foreign language study, etc. It also provides a broader sweep of academia. A Bachelor of Science, as the name suggests, focuses more on science and math. Majors common in this degree are engineering, computer science, mathematics, chemistry, etc. It also provides a more fo focused curriculum. Depending on the field, a BA or BS degree can set you on a different career path. Many majors or fields of study will offer both a BA or BS and it is up to you which route you would like to take. Psychology is a good example of a major where you can decide between degrees. Typically, psychology majors in the BA degree option often go into counseling, while those who earn a BS tend to focus on research. For a student wishing to pursue a PhD in psychology, a BS is a good first step because it will provide understanding of statistics and research methods more than a BA. Computer science is another example where a BA degree program is more specifically oriented toward the interdisciplinary aspect of computer science in which students select a secondary concentration such as business, engineering, science, etc. A BS degree program is geared more towards students interested in becoming engineers. So the main difference there is just the BA is for students who don't want to necessarily be labeled want to be labeled or go into an engineering field, whereas a BS program would be a route that, that students interested more in engineering would like to take. These are just examples though, and the opportunities for either degree are limitless and can be catered to your interests and career goals. Often, students may wonder which of the degrees is better, but both BA and BS degrees can carry equal weight and have aspects that help you to stand out to potential employers. If faced with the choice between the two degree options in the same academic subject, students should consider their own academic strengths and career interests, study the curriculum requirements for each, and reflect on what type of classes they have enjoyed taking in the past. So it really is up to you and about your interests and what you would like to do in both um, career-wise and academic-wise because you also want to be thinking about if you would like to go to graduate school and this is something we'll cover in future videos as well. So now that you know a little bit more about those degrees, what those degree titles mean, let's explore some of the academic opportunities at SIU. So SIU has over 200 majors, minors, and specifications. There are eight colleges, including the Agricultural Sciences, Applied Sciences and Arts, Business, Education and Human Services, Engineering, Liberal Arts, Mass Communication and Media Arts, and Science. There are also three schools, the Graduate School, School of Law, and School of Medicine. In the upcoming slides, I will briefly go over each college and their majors. So the College of Agriculture has seven undergraduate majors as well as 26 specializations. These do include agribusiness economics, agricultural systems, animal science, crop soil environmental management, forestry, horticulture, and human nutrition and dietetics. College of Applied Sciences and Arts has 14 bachelor's degrees as well as a number of different specializations. And of course, the majors include architectural studies, automotive technology, aviation management, aviation technologies, 
dental hygiene, electronic systems technologies, fashion design and merchandising, public safety management, healthcare management, information system technologies, interior design, mortuary science and funeral service, radiologic sciences, techni technical resource management. College of Business has eight undergraduate majors as well as multiple different specializations that you can go into. And the majors include accounting, business analytics, business administration, economics, finance, hospitality, tourism, and event management, management, and marketing. The College of Education and Human Services has 22 undergraduate majors along with a plethora of different specializations that you can include. And these include agriculture education, art education, behavior analysis and therapy, biological science education, communication disorder and sciences, early childhood, elementary education, English language arts, exercise science, foreign languages, history education, leisure services management, mathematics education, music education, public health, outdoor recreation leadership and management, rehabilitation services, social work, special education, sport administration, therapeutic rec recreation, and workforce education and development. The College of Engineering has seven undergraduate majors, again, with multiple different areas that you can pursue and different specializations that you can attach to these different majors. And these majors include civil engineering, electrical engineering, computer engineering, industrial management and applied engineering, electrical engineering technology, mechanical engineering, and mining. The College of Liberal Arts has over 28 undergraduate majors as well as 36 minors and also includes a lot of different specializations that you can attach with your major or minor. And these include Africana Studies, Anthropology, Art, Classics, Communication Studies, Criminology and Criminal Justice, Design, Economics, English, Foreign Language and International Trade, French, Geography and Envi Environmental Resources, German, History, International Studies, Linguistics, Music, Musical Theater, Paralegal Studies, Philosophy, Political Science, Psychology, Sociology, Spanish, Speech Communication, Theater, and University Studies. The College of Mass Communication and Media Arts has a cinema and photography program with specializations including cinema, fine arts photography, commercial photography, and a journalism program where you can specialize in advertising, news, photojournalism, sports media, and a radio, television, and digital media program where you can specialize in digital media arts and animation, electronic journalism, media industries, radio audio production, television video production, and sports media. The College of Science has majors in biological sciences, chemistry and biochemistry, computer science, geology, mathematics, microbiology, physics, plant biology, zoology, and physiology. And again, there are multiple different specializations and minors that you can do within the College of Science as well. So want more information on the specific programs or majors that you just saw? There are many ways to go about doing so. You could directly go to the college or department website and look around on it to gather more information, or you could contact the undergraduate advisement for the college and major that you're interested in because each college has an undergraduate advisement office. So you can ask them any questions that you might have regarding the program or the college itself. And we also recommend you to talk to us at the Career Development Center um, for a major in career exploration appointment where we will go into more depth in the academic programs and provide more insight on career opportunities relating to that major or field of study. If you have any questions or need assistance, again, please contact us at the SAU Career Development Center. We're always really happy to help prospective, current, or even alumni students at SIU with any professional or career development questions you may have. Please join us for future videos in the success program. Thanks for watching this video. Bye-bye.